Jerome's got to get it in. It's Hunter for three. You called it. A bank. It's open late. And Virginia wins number one and holding. That was about as improbable as it, as it gets. Did not feel like we were going to win that game at all, but then that crazy last sequence of events. Virginia doing what they always do. Jerome, yes and one. Everything had to go right for us, which it did, and guys made some plays and did some really good things. And then everything had to go you know, off or wrong for Louisville, whether it's missed free throws or so many little things. I think we didn't want to lose so bad that we never let it creep into, into, into the people who were on the floor's mind. You know, plays happened in our, it was definitely luck went into it. We, plays went our way. You know, stuff that doesn't happen a lot started to happen and, you know, it was the perfect way to end it. He moved on the baseline. Oh my goodness. There's enough time for a catch and shoot. Jerome's got to get it in. It's Hunter for three. You called it. A bank. It's open late. And Virginia wins number one and holding. Actually, I think he didn't quite go to the right spot. We were supposed to do something else. And, and Louisville did a good job guarding it. And he sort of just spaced. And then Ty, Jerome actually made a fake and just kind of got it to him and how quickly he got it off. Jerry's three was nuts. That's, the, that's probably one of the most exciting feelings post game we've ever felt. There's no way he just made that. And then I hear the crowd get silent for like a split second, and then our fans started going crazy and then turned around and just tackled them. I remember sprinting on the court, running on him, then hearing Isaiah cough, because everyone was crushing him, and then to get off him. That in particular was um, an unexpected gift, let's put it that way. And, and you know, there's just something that's great about the game to see guys, you know, running down the court and jumping on each other, and then the celebration in the locker room.